it's me again, Amy with Bargain Mama, and I literally turned the video off and turned it right back on because I've got to get out and see my home health patients, but I really wanted to show you guys some friend mail that I got. So I'm not gonna show you the package because it has my address and it has hers, but I have my address on my community page, so it doesn't matter, but hers is on there. But I am gonna show you this cute card that came with it. My favorite color is pink, and then it does say March of 2021. I was trying to see if she made it. I think, I know she put this on there, you can tell. Sorry, I'm trying to figure out what is going on. My dogs are having a day. So she put these, yes, I just wanna make sure there's no personal information. First of all, she put these beautiful stickers on there. I can tell she did that, I love them. And then she put these beautiful stickers at the bottom. And it says, hi Amy, thank you for all your fun videos. I'm sending various items for your residents to use in their crafting projects. Keep up the great work that you do, Amanda L. So, this means the world to me because I don't mind spending my own money on it. Like when I see stuff, I will pick it up. But it is so amazing when other people think of my residents too. I don't know if I've told you guys, but we are open. Our residents are able to see their family members for the first time in a year. They, there was crying. I got goosebumps right now. Last Thursday when it opened up, there was crying. There was everything. It was amazing. So they are able to see their family members. They are not able to leave yet, but their family members can bring them stuff, but they still can't leave but this is a huge jump. But when you guys think of things to send my residents, that is absolutely amazing. And we are doing, um, we are going to put together a little paint, paint and sip night um, for our residents um, in the next two weeks. And we are going to group the tables by um, cognition, by um, what they're able to do. So like I'll run one, run one group and I'll bring the decorations and all the stuff for my group. Um, obviously it will be like grape juice um, and snacks and then like the next group. Um, so I might have, depending on what group I have, I will buy a lot of the wood signs from Dollar Tree that are already done um, and they can just paint them versus other people who have amazing talents. They, we might bring for one group just the canvases. So anyways, I just wanted to say, yes, I love that people think of my residents because trust me, I think of my residents every single day. Like I absolutely love what I do. It just, so I just want to say thank you, Amanda, for thinking of my residents and I cannot wait to take this to them. So let me just, I don't even know where to start. There's so many things. So I, so I think she put this on all of them. I'm pretty sure. So it says best mail ever, which is true. Very true. So this one has some black, thick black. I don't want to open all of it if I don't have to, just because it's going to be easier to give um, to my residents or give to the um, activities lady in charge of our residents. Um, so this is a thick black and white checkered, um, um, oh my gosh, Amy, ribbon. We have the blue ribbon. All these orange pom-poms, which is funny because I just made a gnome with one of my residents and we didn't have any pom-poms, which I was going to pick up, obviously, but they're in here. The thinner checkered thing, I can't see this one. What is this? This is like some sort of a very, very thin string, so that is going to be useful. And then here is a thing by Craft Essentials of like a red or maroon and white um, dotted ribbon. Very, very excited about that. This one I am thinking I'm going to have to open. It says happiness inside, best mail ever. Again, yes it is. Oh, that just opens right up so I can reseal it. So let's see what's in here. So since these didn't want to come out, they don't have to. All, look at all these beautiful doilies. They are blue and yellow, which is great for summer. On the back, if they don't want to use the blue and yellow, they're an off-white. Very pretty. Here is some scrapbook paper with doves on it. A lot of little tags for my residents. Love this. Here is a little bird that goes perfect with that other paper. Here are, I'm trying to show you guys, um, more tags. And here is this beautiful larger tag. So here, a bunch of, what is this one? That one's cute. What does it say? How sweet. Yes, it is very sweet. Ooh, I love these. I don't know if you made them. If you did, please tell me. And I would love to know how to do it also because those are so cute little envelopes. I do love this little angel and I already know what one of my residents is going to absolutely love that angel. And then let's see here. I feel like some of this you made for sure. I don't know. Let me know. So I'm trying to get stuff open. This is a little 
like table card thing, which some of this stuff I'm already in my mind thinking I may not give to my residents, but some of this stuff I already in my mind can tell that we could so use for paint night. So here is this very cute, it says two from, but this right here is real fabric guys, which is a great idea. I might, I'm gonna have to take a picture of that to put into my stuff too. Another name card I can use for paint and sip night. Little mittens, that is a notebook. Um, these little, um, sorry, I think somebody's outside. So I just want to warn you guys, if my older son comes in right now, if that's him, my dogs are going to go crazy. Like they haven't this whole time. The little camera, a heart. Oh, I think there's a couple of hearts here. Yeah. And so they can either use the orange side or the white side. These beautiful butterflies. And this says, love you all so much. That beautiful. Here is, are some heart things. This beautiful paper right here. I love that. These are some little two-sided paper here. Oh, these are pretty. Oh, wait. wait. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's okay. They do go together. Those are very pretty. Love those bird colors. I'm telling you, these are going to be so helpful with paint night and for anything else because they love it. Oh, look, she already cut the raccoon out. Um, here's this one. This one is absolutely cute. I love the little bathing suit. So cute. Got that one. Flip flops. I love the colors of those. I really love these. These are so summery. So they are going to be amazing for, um, our patients. So I was trying to see if this is two-sided. It is. There's those beautiful flamingos and there's that. And I love that they're already cut and they're not square because that is so much easier for my residents. Because yes, if you watched one of my other videos, one of my residents made a gorgeous, gorgeous um, junk journal, but not all of them have that kind of dexterity in their hands and stuff like that. So if they're already cut out for them kind of like this, it makes it so much easier and they can still make these beautiful projects and not have to worry about um, waiting for me to cut it or something else. So here are some more summer things. And I do want to tell you guys, I cannot wait to show you guys the gnome that my, it's the first gnome I've ever made in my life. Um, I guess I didn't make it. My patient made it. She begged me if we could make it. So we did. Ooh, these are gorgeous. These are layered glitter stickers. You guys see that? So we made a gnome, a St. Patrick's Day gnome. She was so excited. I was excited. Okay, so these are stickers. I think I don't think I'm gonna undo them. So I'm gonna try to show you just like this. Those are beautiful stickers. I love those. Um, there's some more birds for them. Are they are definitely into nature? I love those. She can save those for like um, Thanksgiving and stuff. Oh, you know what though? These have numbers and stuff on them. I may use these for um, my home health patients. Some of these, now that I think about it, I may use um, some of this Happy Mail stuff from like these right here. I feel like my, um, when I do projects with my kids, um, my home health kids, they would love it. So I might divide this up between both. These beautiful blue bows, the music items. These are all stickers. The pigs, guys, how cute are these pigs? I already know who's gonna love those. And then this says summer fun, which is again, the perfect time. I'm not gonna put those back in the bag right now because yeah, there's a lot. So let me see. Oh my goodness, I don't even know how to open this. There is a lot going on in here. Okay, <laughs> how cute are these? They are a bunch of little um, clothespins. I love those. Oh, these are crosses, guys. Can you see that? Crosses and doves for like, um, um, shakers. I love those. I'm thinking in my mind of who would use all of these things who, I mean, like not one person, but I mean individually who I could give these to and they're going to love them buttons or who I can do projects with that are going to love them. All the sequins and stuff, which are going to be great for our gnomes. Cause we're trying to find stuff to embellish our gnomes. Um, all these little clothespins, <laughs> um, paper clips. I mean, I love those. I love, Oh, look at this side of them. Those are cute, I love that. Um, here are some 3D foam stickers with animals, butterflies, love. There's some googly eyes. Um, here is a pin that says Drama Queen. And this says, with, break, with brave wings, she flies. Um, so 
I do have to tell you, which is very, she's, she's good. But so if you did again, watch my video previously, um, of the, um, junk journal scrapbook item that one of my patients made me, she is unfortunately, obviously HIPAA. I didn't never told you her name or anything, but she's in the hospital. Unfortunately, um, she's been in there since Saturday. I did just receive news today that she is out of ICU. So I'm very excited. Um, so yeah, um, I just wanted to say that because I think that's, it made me think with that brave, with brave wings, she flies. I think I want to give that to her, um, just because of what happened. But anyways, keep going. These are little, um, index cards, which are so cute. I love that little owl and stuff on the front and she tied them together. Um, this is a bunch of beautiful colored, um, envelopes and scrapbook paper. Are they all envelopes or are they scrapbook paper? Oh, and books. Not trying to go fast. Um, I just oh, didn't realize the time, and I have a patient to go see. But love all those. They are envelopes and stuff. These are different kinds of lined paper. Um, and so yeah, this one is a bunch of different paper and colors and stuff like that that they can use, um, which they will love. Again, um, it makes it a lot more convenient when, well, not really convenient, but it makes it a lot, I guess, easier when they're in different sizes and stuff and shapes so that um, they can pick out of those and not have to wait for me to finish cutting one person so I can cut another person's. Um, and then I think I'm on the last thing. I just want to look around, make sure I didn't forget anything. So I did receive, there's more in here. Um, okay, so it is a bunch of paper right here, um, different sizes. This is two-sided paper that is just beautiful. Um, sorry, I just had something come across the top from one of my jobs about COVID. Um, so I was just trying to see if I needed to see it right now. Um, this right here I think is so cute because I have those pens or um, the white kind of paint pens from before. So I think this is gonna be good for some of my patients. Um, so yeah. I, I really like that. Let me put it back in here, just this one. Okay, let me just put some of it back in here. I'm sorry, guys. So that I don't have to do as much when the video is off, and I'm going to drop it. Okay. And so then we have, I'm sorry, excuse me, um, different paper that is this square size. Let's see. Um, Two-sided. Again, ooh, that is beautiful. I love the different colors of this. Look at these colors, guys. They're so pretty. So I got those ones. Let me put them in here. Um, so sometimes with paint and sip, and other people like to paint. Sometimes they want to just glue stuff onto something, which is fine. It's more about, you know, spending time with us and everything and knowing that they can do different things than just sit there. And let me tell you, they like their bingo, though. Do not interrupt their bingo. So there is that. And then these are all just different beautiful paper for them that is pretty large, which is nice. I love, like I said, that all the different sizes so that we can distribute different um, things onto different tables um, so that it's not just like, well, if you want that, you're gonna have to go to the other table, but that table's not really appropriate for you. You know, that kind of thing. She did send me some bags, some paper bags, so they can do um, um, like the, the decorated bags. Um, some more paper, which is gorgeous. Ooh, like that one. An envelope. And then some more different sized paper. And then this one, it looks like, oh, and I have this, oh my gosh, this right here that says be authentic. It's a thick chipboard. And then we have this, which is a bunch of tags. I mean, you can see how many is in there on this size. And it says happiness inside, which again, it is. So that is all, oh my gosh. Amanda L., thank you so much for thinking of my residents. They are absolutely going to love it. The activities director is absolutely going to love it because her budget since COVID-19 has been cut to pretty much nothing. So I do like to pick up um, different items um, from like Dollar Tree and stuff like that just to put in um, the bingo prize bin so that they have something. Because if not, she's picking it all up with her own money. And um, yeah, I just don't think it's fair, but you know, COVID-19 has kind of put down a lot of stuff and it has put a lot of buildings and companies into financial difficulties. So they have kind of cut back on our activities. So occupational therapy is finding things um, that people can do um, 
and adapting it to their needs. So it makes it very convenient that I can go to the Dollar Tree and buy this stuff and still let my patients feel like they are not missing out on anything. So the fact, Amanda, that you sent me all this stuff is absolutely amazing and they are going to love this. I wish I could have them say that they love it themselves, but again, they can't. Um, but I just want to say thank you so much for thinking of my residents and um, I hope that you are having an amazing day and um, yes, thank you so much. And again, to everyone else, I hope that you're having an amazing day. Um, also, I posted, I'm going to say this a couple of videos and then that's it. I did um, decide to do an Instagram. I've never done Instagram before. You know, so I don't edit my videos. I don't really know much about technology, um, but I did decide to put up an Instagram. So my husband and my son helped me this morning. So if you want to um, join me on Instagram, it is Amy Bargain Mama. And if you have an Instagram, I would love to follow you. So please post your link or your name below and I will definitely follow you because I love that you can scroll through the pictures really quick and see what's going on when sometimes you don't have all the time in the world to sit and watch a video. So I'm definitely a scroller for real quick. So I am thinking I might like Instagram a little better. I'm not sure. But anyways, with that being said, I hope you're all having a great day and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye guys.